Welcome back. Uh, I'm here joined by the world champion Magnus Carlsen, who uh, kindly agreed to show us his uh, victory over Shahriar Mamidjara for a fast game for you. We did not expect it to go this yeah. quickly somehow. Um, no, uh, but it has to be said that uh, in, a t in a situation like this, uh, where a win would be really, really nice, uh, Shah is not the worst player to play with. Absolutely, yeah. To play with uh, with Black, so... Um, well, this is kind of a fashionable line. Um, and but not really connected with e takes d4. No, exactly, but I, I mean, at the board I was just cursing myself that I forgot to, uh, to check this stuff before the game, because uh, I don't know if he's played it in this position, but he likes it in similar position. I think he beat Boris once, like, yeah, in a very similar... Uh, position, but at the same time, I remember that it's not at all dangerous objectively. Uh, yeah, and we were actually kind of surprised because I assumed he was going to play the a3 queen takes d4 line, yeah. which doesn't really seem to s doesn't suit his style all that much. And I thought no. this might be a quiet game, but it wasn't. Yeah, no, I mean usually, I mean people try some stuff, and if black is accurate, then it's a uh, it's a short draw. But yeah, uh, um, yeah. So, uh, I mean, actually, he real in the game, he really needs the rooks on d1 and e1. Uh, yeah, I thought, I thought it would be long on e1, but I wasn't yeah, sure how to get okay, it correctly. I think, I think somehow this is how people play. And knight g3 is already quite committal, I think. Yeah. Uh, but what else, what else is he supposed uh, to do? I don't know. I mean, the, I mean, if he can get a3, b4, and knight c5, that would be nice, but I don't think he's in time for that. Knight it, c5 it does seem like he, your play is just so much simpler here. Yeah. And here, I mean, I was checking this for a long time, but I, I, I just couldn't see what he had, like, after bishop d3, I think. Maybe even Both f5, f5 yeah. and g6 are playable. For instance, like, g6, queen e3, bishop e8. I mean, you can try some stuff like this, uh, but it seems that he's the one who's trying to uh, trying to equalize uh, to me. Yeah, we thought you were doing well, but, yeah. s but still... The, the and then, I mean, here... He said he missed rook d6 here, but I think... I mean, of course, bishop a2, bishop b1 is coming, but it's not very frightening. Uh, but I think after... Here he really needs to go d5, probably. Uh, and it's pretty miserable, but... Oh, you, you take and go rook a d8. Yeah, so. I mean, black is better for sure, but... Uh, um, but yeah, you, uh, you can understand why he didn't want Yeah, of to course, but I think here after queen g4, rook d8, knight e4, rook d7 doesn't lead anywhere. I mean, after knight e4, even rook d4, knight e4, knight e4 is probably much better for black. Uh, and d5, queen f8, I, I just couldn't see anything for him. Yeah, I don't think there is anything yeah. good here, but uh, what he did just doesn't work at yeah, all. But no. I guess by this point he realized the game is not really going very yeah. well. And he yeah, so of course knight e4, knight h5, it just f5 works. And uh, no, it, I thought maybe bishop a2 or bishop b3 uh, yeah, to force you to point, take yeah, at yeah, least. Exactly, yeah. exactly. Yeah. But Wait for I take knight f5, knight f5 bishop d7. I mean bishop d7 even. Yeah. And he cannot, he cannot go rook d5 because I just take... And uh, bishop f5 and knight d7. Yeah, it, it looks like a bad position yeah, already. It's, it's uh, I mean, uh, it's just a very healthy pawn. And probably more than that. Yeah. Very possible. Yeah, I mean, this bishop it's is a just nice so, piece, yeah. so, so strong. Yeah. yeah. But here. I mean, at least he needs to go bishop c4 here. But after queen f6, I mean, even but if after queen f6, and I thought takes yeah. gf knight d4, uh, and uh, oh, actually some some jumps are still available. Yeah, some jumps. So maybe I have to take mm -hmm. bishop c6. It's a very healthy extra pawn, yes. but it's still a bit of work. Yeah, but uh, I mean, this just collapses him. Yeah, he, he gets, an, uh, yeah. I, and it's understandable that he became somewhat disillusioned with yeah. his situation. No, I, I understood from far away that Bishop F5 was his idea, but yeah, it just, yeah, it just resigns. Yeah. 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 So, uh, seemingly, uh, you know, considering the state of the tournament, a very, very nice, uh, you know, efficient win for you. And uh Yeah, I mean, now, uh, draw tomorrow, 
guarantees. Probably uh, guarantees a tie for first and a tie break. Yeah. yeah. So this is um, obviously, I mean, beyond what I could have hoped for today. So and uh, apparently, people who are you know stats inclined tell us that you you keep on beating him in less than thirty moves, as in in Shamkir in both. To, to in 14 and 15, you've you've had quick victories against him. So yeah, so he can play extremely well, but it doesn't. He doesn't deal very well with uh, with bad trends in games, basically. So yeah, I think the moment he realized it wasn't going well today, he, yeah. he became uh, very upset. It, it, it yeah. looked like he wasn't he wasn't happy at all with how the no, game was progressing. No, no, and uh, I mean, so, so then then it can just go downhill very quickly. Sure, uh, it's f not only uh, applies to him. I guess there's uh, lots of yeah, of lots course, of people of course, like that. Uh, what do you think is going on in the Kramnik Sugirov game? If you oh, yeah. if you were watching at um, all, let's maybe bring. Uh, let me just yeah. bring this up. If we can ask your opinion, because we, we we couldn't really work out what was going on there. Yeah. So. Um, and the connecting question: Do you have a preference as to who you will be playing? Uh, tomorrow? No, not really. Uh, but Ch a chance to settle the scores with Sanan, maybe? Yeah, sure. <laughs> sure, but uh, I mean, if he wins this, I'll be really, really impressed. Yeah, it doesn't, it doesn't seem like he's doing yeah. uh, that well, but it's a sharp position. Yeah, which it's a sharp position. So, it's interesting, this, this line. Yeah, it's, it's a very... Usually one would think that White should go H3 in this position. Yeah, he just completely ignored it. And also, apparently, bishop d3, knight h5, bishop e3 has been played in two previous games by Ilyanov and Kamsky. So people, yeah. people have been doing this constantly. Yeah, I mean, uh, when, when you go for queen b3 and knight h4, this is a, at least a semi-serious attempt at an advantage. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. But uh, what I mean is, even after taking on g6, your suggestion of h3, people for some yeah. reason are... Ah. They are, they are Even if yeah, bishop d3, bishop b3 is what yeah. has been played by Ilyanov okay. and Kamsky previously. Maybe it's Kramnik knight g5 h5 and g5 or something. Maybe, yeah. So yeah, okay. But, uh, so what, um, what do you think is happening right now? So I think this is what happened in my game with what I Very play. close to it at least, yeah. Maybe yeah, exactly. I think, like I think this and he went bishop e4. Oh yeah. And which I think makes more sense because I took... Uh, took uh, yeah, he put, he put bishop on d6. And bishop d6, and it seems that this should be favorable. Uh, well, at least compared to the uh, game. Compared to, yeah. I mean, uh, there is no qu uh, question of back, back being better, of course. But, uh, yeah. it's, it's a game, but uh, here, this seems very playable for, uh, for, uh, for white. I mean, we have these systems in the Ragusin where you hunt the bishop, and it seems that white is way ahead of... Uh, those positions. Mm. I I, uh, I guess that objectively black should still be right, but now with long castle, I well don't the know. The thing is, he he's not going to move the knight on c4. That's ah, the, I don't. So I don't think he is anyway. So you think he, he you, you need to just keep it there and allow allow white to take because yeah, I thought knight a3 check, but it just gets captured there. You would, if you could play knight a3 check, you probably would play knight a3. Yeah, but yeah, just g3 and and b4, yeah, yeah, or maybe b4 immediately. Yeah, or b4 immediately. So, but can you can you make it work? Because uh, I don't know if you leave it here right now. I think also the knight on g5 is very annoying. So you can never get king c7 rook. Yeah. So a, a very interesting maybe, position. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Let's How? just try it. For okay, it. knight of seven. Knight of seven. Look at it. Whoa, knight d6. Knight d6, queen a6, yeah. knight b5. Knight b5, queen, king d7. King d7. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this, this escalated quickly. Yeah. Uh, but Probably bishop b2. Exactly. Yeah, well, sadly this probably doesn't yeah. work. Yeah, bishop b2, queen a2, check, king c1, and it's just one check. Yeah. This is probably a bit too wild, but... Yeah, but I think... But you do, you do need to bring your pieces yeah. to, to the a-file kind of quick, unless, you know... Uh, can you? Yeah, you can try f6, maybe. Ah, yeah. Bishop f4 is impossible of yeah. knight f3 because of knight f3 check, of course, so the knight needs to leave. And then we can try doing something similar. Yeah, yeah, king c7. Yeah, this is interesting. And now, if g3. Can we completely yeah, ignore now we yeah, just both go for knights? It. Yeah, yeah, just go for it. Rook a8 and. Now, this is very, very curious. If he goes for this, it's going to be a very exciting game yeah. to, to commentate on. 
Isn't it so easy to sacrifice other people's yeah, this is Yeah, this is a very privileged situation. <laughs> yeah, when you, you, you see those knights on C4 and F4 and you just pay no attention to them because they're not yours. Yeah. But yeah, we don't know. We don't know if it's correct or yeah. not. But here, I have a feeling that black actually could be doing could be doing could quite be, well. Yeah. yeah, I don't know if you if you need to. Yeah, I don't know. What, I don't know what I was supposed to suggest here. Yeah, looks very very interesting at the very yeah, least. Yeah, I mean, extremely dangerous. So, so f six, can we F6, make yeah. a smarter move somehow? Still thinking. Yeah, I thought Vladimir changed his pose. So I thought maybe the move has been made, but no. no, no. You could you could try playing g three maybe but yeah g three yeah. but takes takes yeah. takes on the four why is this so yeah. bad for black okay now you probably start taking something taking the knight yeah. okay so maybe this is more clever g three takes takes but probably we don't need to spend yeah. the tempo so on taking king g seven king d seven or c seven yeah d seven yeah looks better looks better yeah yeah. Great for us, uh, yeah. committing to this for, for Segirov, especially considering that he's and actually... And now the queen is coming to g6. Yeah, this is much better version for... Uh, for, for and the king is coming to c2. Yeah. But still, a very curious yeah. idea, which wouldn't, wouldn't actually have occurred to me, at no. least not immediately. So it's yeah, I think probably f6 is forced. I mean, after knight f3, king c7... Yeah, this looks promising, actually. Yeah. This does look very promising for black. You, yeah. But... Uh, for him, considering the fact that he's currently tied for first, and he, he I mean, it would be nice for him to be yeah. tied for first again after this round, but he doesn't really need to beat Kramnik with black. No, him, but at this point, I think there's just... Retreating is not an option, you think? Yeah. Russians don't retreat, isn't that? Uh, that's uh, uh, Sergei Karakin's uh, motto, yeah. yeah. Uh, and, uh, uh, yeah, inter yeah, interesting to watch. So uh, probably we'll decide the the question who you will be playing tomorrow yeah. on this board, I guess. Yeah. yeah but uh, it's very nice fighting game. Yeah. yeah. How do you feel about uh, midday rounds? Uh, not too brilliant. This is why I'm really, really uh, happy not to have to win on demand tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, that that. Uh, so at least I have I have some leeway. Um, so. Uh, yeah, I mean, basically this tournament, I've tried to adjust a bit, but I, I just can't sleep at night. Still, so even uh, yeah, even now, so I cannot sleep. A so week and a bit in. That's uh um, so um, it's gonna be interesting. Uh, <laughs> but uh, uh, again, I'm happy to ha at least um, not be in a must win. Yeah, it should be a reasonably comfortable, comfortable situation. You probably will be white as well. Most. Yeah, likely. I think since I'm highest rated, I yeah, should well change color. Yeah. We we discussed this yeah. scenario. We 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 understand that you should be white in most cases. So, yeah. well, thanks thanks for coming in and thanks for explaining to me what's yeah. going on in the Kramnik game because I was completely lost there. <laughs> and uh, we wish you all the best in the remainder uh, of the tournament. Let's just see what move he made. Uh, he played something. Yeah, ah, you see. But maybe maybe he saw uh, g this G three stuff and didn't like it. But maybe yeah. yeah. But it's it's a bit sad from from my viewpoint yeah. because it would be much f much more yeah. interesting to yeah. Okay, I'm supposed to sit till you're <laughs> 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 Yeah yeah. Okay.